I'm with seniors Matthew Bedell and Tanner too after the 79-44 win over Shaker. I mean, talk to me, Tanner, you got hot in that second quarter scoring. I mean, you hit four threes. Talk to me, talk to me about your performance tonight. Um, just my teammates got me open most of the time, just give me an open shot, just I had to knock them down. So. I mean, Coach touched on, obviously you're shooting, but he, he touched on your ability in the press. Do you think your defense is kind of an overlooked aspect, aspect of your game? Uh, not really, but on some days it's not always there defensively. You just had to pick it up. I mean, I'm, to you, Bedell, I mean, you guys move on to four and five on the road. How good does it feel to get a, a big road game in the, com in the oh, conference? Yeah, it's, it's a big one on the road in the conference to get a big one like that. And then, especially going into the playoffs, we got two more games and then playoff time, that's when it really starts to matter. So it's, it's good to go on a roll. I mean, you talk about going on a roll and playing your best basketball, getting ready for playoff time. You guys have won eight of your last 12 games of late, as of late. Talk to me, what what, have, what are you starting to see from your team on this at, during this back end stretch of the year? Yeah, I think we're scoring a lot more points. Like you said, in the games we're winning, we're averaging like 95 points a game. And we just got to cut down turnovers and then make other teams turn the ball over. So we'll be in really good shape. I mean, what do you what what leads you guys scoring so many points? I mean, you guys have t passed a hundred multiple times. You guys scoring the nineties a lot, eighties a lot. What allows you guys to be so dynamic offensively? It's just the tempo we play at and trusting the whole game. A lot of teams don't don't do that; they're not used to it, so they get tired, and then that's when we make our big runs, like how we did tonight in the second quarter. Two, I talked to coach about this GCC chase. You got you win Brunswick now. Say that nine to two. You guys played them earlier in the year at their place. You get them at home. I, mean, I know it's not the next matchup, but I'm I'm assuming. It's in the back of you guys' mind. Can you just talk about that matchup for me? Uh, we're just preparing every day, getting better and better to scout and guard them. Just got to play better like last, other than last time, just get better. I mean, we know about you guys as an offensive team, but tonight you guys play great defensively, holding Shaker to 44 points. I'm going to go to you still. Stick, I'm going to stick with you, Tanner. What what stood out about you guys on the defensive, defensive side of the ball tonight? Uh, we're just very, very conditioned. <laughs> We just like to speed up the other team and get a bunch of steals and fast breaks. I mean, Matt, you touched on that second quarter a little bit. What what split the switch in that second quarter? I talked to Coach. It seemed like the rhythm was slow for both teams, and then you guys just came out and outscored and you got to that 20-5 to five run. Obviously, I know Tanner was a big part of that, but what else stood out in that second quarter? Yeah, I mean, he started hitting shots, and then, like I said, teams get tired, and then I used to, used to playing that fast, and that's what we want to run. I mean, do you think you guys are playing your best basketball as you get into the tournament? How, how ready, how confident do you guys feel? I think we're playing good basketball, but I think we'll be a lot better within this next week. I mean, we have we play tomorrow, and then we have a whole week to prepare for Brunswick, and then I think we'll be a lot better going on the playoffs. Anything else you guys want to say before I let y'all get out of here? Yeah, good. Thank you, guys. Thank you, guys. Thank you.